Hey guys and gals, Malkuth, 1974, back at you with episode number five of Buzz Aldrin's Space Program Manager. Where did we leave off last time? Let's go. So I've been taking a look around, and I think I'm not going to do the Luna Probe yet, but do I even have... I don't think I have anybody researching this, so it's never going to get higher. No. Okay. So... How many controllers do I got? 10 out of 12. Well, let's give the space program a rest with the manned missions, and we will send up the probe to the moon. This is the Lunar Impact probe, the Luna 2 Lunar Impactor. So, I'm going to click that. Schedule the mission. Assemble now. We will use, let's put our old buddy. Olag in there. And get our boosters ready. We will use. Yeah. And 93. And crew and payloads. There we go. Confirm assignments. Yes, it'll cost us a few bucks. <clears throat> Let me see if I can remember. It's been a it's been a, few, a night or so since I've actually used this. So, all right. Pulsion. Uh, why does it show? I have four people, but it didn't show. Let me go back in there. Uh, boom, boom, boom. Uh, so there's nobody here, there's nobody here, there's nobody here. Ah, what is it? Luna 2. So I'll take these guys out of Luna 2. I'm gonna have to be doing EVA soon, so. We'll be sending up the Voshkod pretty soon, too. But. Uh, EBA suits, we need to get these guys going, so... So, project reliability, E27%, alright, so back. Uh, manage rocket program, so real the R7 8K71 is 94. This is my uh, main booster right now, it's 99. Uh, the Luna Booster is, which we will be using on this one, is 91. That's all we have so far. I think I'm gonna kill this. No more Sputnik Booster. Yes, back. And what about payloads? No, we're still using the Vostok. Uh, the Luna 3. Close a Sputnik 2, right? So we can close that. And I got the Luna 2. We don't need this. Alright, so Vostak, Vostak. I think they have this uh, arranged wrong. If you manage rocket programs, you can manage it. But if you manage payloads, all you get is this screen. You can change everybody, but you can't. Well, I guess payloads counts at everything. So manage programs is these. All right. So back to space complex. Uh, so we can train up some astronauts here. Pretty sure a lot of these guys are training, right? Yeah, a lot of these guys are training. Alright, so, end season. Yes. 
Good, good, good. This thing only has an 88% chance, which is pretty low. But you gotta do what you gotta do. It's not as good as the manned space program we have going. <coughs> Sorry about that. I have a few cuts. Countdown. Luckily, I got good mission control people that hopefully can bring up my uh, percentages a little bit. Come on. Boost! Stage six, which is injection. Since we only had issues before. Oh, now we're in transit. Success. We should go to eight. Should be uh, moon approach and impact. Yeah. All right, so we are literally kicking some butt. Nice. Done. So that brings up our Luna booster to 95.2, which is awesome. So the Americans have done a uncrewed Gemini heat shield test. All right, so we have to get a few things moving here. <sighs> I got one astronaut available. I got all my mission controllers back. Let's open up the astronauts. He's 83. Two seasons. I got him available. I need a good guy here. 90 piloting. 92. 89. I need two pilots though. No, actually, what we can do... Can I do two programs yet? No. What I need to do is upgrade this building. So... Mission Control in the place you can manage a group like controls which are responsible. Level 3 allows you to expand the capacity to groups of 22 employees. Alright, so that's what I want. Because I need a... If I want to start running two, uh, two missions per season, then I have to uh, get that upgraded before I can get some more flight control dudes working so no exit construction thank you <clears throat> I'm gonna start getting my Gemini program we're up and running so alright Right, uncrewed. We'll do this. Schedule mission. Assemble now. Woo! 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Yeah, because. <clears throat> well, let's put. Where the hell is, uh. Oh, here he is. <laughs> Olog. Boosters. Retro. Uh, Ecom. We will put him in there. Procedures. Put him in there. Fido. Now we can just kind of get everybody 
working. Uh, so this guy needs to be pretty damn spiffy. AFD. I need another guy that's good, as good as Olog. Alright, so confirm. Wow, spend submission. Alright, back to vehicle complex. And I still have a few mission control guys. I still have a few tests, so let's get a f these guys. Oh, wrong one. Advanced training. This guy is pretty hot. But we'll get his mission operations up too. Wait. Propulsion, yeah, his propulsion is pretty sad. Propulsion. Is that everybody? Yep, okay. Back. One astronaut. We don't actually need him open. some EVA going here. Training. <clears throat> there we go. And it's up to 38%. Proceed. 93%. Launch mission. Monitor from mission control, baby. problems on this one. Get the bugs worked out of the system. I believe these guys just land. These this is the first one where the the guys actually land in Russia. They don't get ejected like in the other ones. Uh oh. Alright. So that should give us a good boost to our rocket system here. Done. So uh, the Voskhod booster is up to 99 and the Voskhod spacecraft is up to 91.9%. Alright. <clears throat> Alright. So... I got eight guys open, so I need to start putting some guys on some new uh, things here. And I don't know the Soyuz. I'm pretty sure I don't need any of these guys for any of this stuff, but I do need somebody for the EVA. I can get somebody going on Soyuz. Soyuz.
Why should I not play with that yet? Let's open it. <clears throat> and we'll need to use all my rockets are good so I'm saying we should get into this thing which can uh, help Should I skip the moyos? The mole, manale. I don't know. Let me see. We'll open it up. Mission screen. Research and development. It's already at 74%. So let's get two guys on that. And we will get a bunch of people to work on this. And let's get the EVA suits working up here. No, nope. wrong one. Manage payload. Uh, we'll put one more guy. Let me see if I can. Uh, EVA suits, EVA suits, EVA suits, EVA suits. All right. That leaves me one guy to maybe start working on the Luna 15, which will open it up. I'm not going to worry about the booster because I think the booster. is going to be something different. And we're working on this Soyuz stuff right now. So, R&D. We'll get this guy to work on that. Back to complex. There we go. So, all my guys are working. I believe the next one is another test. <clears throat> we're to go back to Bosch God. We need to do the suborbital. F no, see, that has a person in it. Thinking we're gonna do well. If I do it, do I have enough mission controllers open? I need three astronauts. I'm thinking about one more test flight. This might not be the most smartest thing to do. But it'll get my controllers up. And da, 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 da. let's get this guy on e ecom. Fido guidance. Uh, procedures needs to be. Thinking that this guy should be this guy. Spacecraft positions. And procedures. So I still need three guys. One guy's an astronaut, so two other guys. I need more, uh, I need to hire more people. Which is why we are uh, upgrading that. Might have to upgrade this too. Let's upgrade my astronaut complex. Upgrade. That doesn't quite need an upgrade yet. So everything is cool. I have one astronaut that's not doing anything. <clears throat> So here we go. There are scheduled missions that have not been assembled yet. 
What mission is that? What the hell are they talking about? Not required, not required, not required. Okay, what firm assignments? Oh, okay. Back. End season. One more test flight. So we're uh, we're learning our uh, astronaut flight suits. Uh, we're using, working on the Soyuz, and we're working on upgrading to the Molenaya booster. And we are working. One guy is working on a Luna 15. This is the sample return mission that the Russians did. So we'll go to proceed. 95%. Monitor. Let's get this thing to go a little bit more. <clears throat> Americans might beat me to this, but whatever. We want a safe program. Because if you lose a lot of stuff, it's not good. You don't get as much prestige as you would on a second doing a mission again. But you, you increase the reliability, of course, of your uh, mission control guys and the systems themselves that are being used, like the rocket and uh, the pod. And I just want to get that pod up there. I want to make sure. Everything's going good. It's right about here that things start going a little bit tricky. Yeah, I think this is a. Uh, now it was this part right here. Things started going. Ooh. Actually, we did good on this. It was the landing that was. It must have been the pickup of the of the vest of the thing. Oh, we're all good. Recovery, success. Awesome. So now I see I only got 200, uh, 100 points there, but see how my uh, my spacecraft is now at 94.3 and my Vostok is at 99.8. So that's really what I wanted to do. And we'll see if the Americans have beat us with the two-man crew getting the Mercury up there. No. All right, astronauts who graduated. Launch, finish the sexual mission, open programs, bomb programs have been opened, so use. Yep, Luna upgrade process for the following building has started, Cosmonaut, and the upgrade process for the following buildings has ended. Mission control. So that's that's good. So I need to hire some more mission control people. Let's get some guys in here. Looking for some heavyweights. So this guy these guys this guy this guy this guy it's not too many better choices here uh this guy how many is that one two three four five six okay high recruits yes Okay, you see I'm still making money every oh, so often. <clears throat> and now we are going to launch two men into space. So... Remove. 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 That gives me twelve. I don't. I think I need thirteen. Yeah, because it adds. <clears throat> so. I don't know. We'll find out. Let's see if we can put this mission together here. Actually, I can launch 
on crew ballistic. We can do this again. Armor flight. We can do this. We can use the Vostok, which is our best, best, best one. Schedule mission. Assemble now. We will put him into Olog where he belongs, and we'll put Analo and Tonally here. Uh, get this guy here, and I need environmental spacecraft systems, and then systems guy will go here, 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 here. Procedures will be. This dude, surgeon will be him. Capcom this time will be there. We go. <clears throat> Confirm assignments, and our astronaut going to space will be this guy. He's probably been there a couple times, but confirm assignments. Could cost us some bucks. Which is fine. How many? These guys got two seasons. So it's going to be at least two seasons before I can get anybody into there. So let's. 38. Uh... Alright. So nobody's open. We got five, ten. We are good. What do I got? Do I got anybody training or are all these guys now researching? I probably need some more researchers, huh? So I should be coming on my four year cycle pretty soon. Can I hire any more researchers? Oh yeah. I need a lot of EVA suits. I know I got a bunch of guys. I'm just trying to get. Ah, this guy's good. Space probes. go. So I got some new guys in training. And astronaut complex, I will be getting some more. Or can I hire some now? Yeah, we're just going all out getting people. Hire recruits. Go. Back. So, we're good to go. That's moving up nicely. Soyuz is moving up nicely. This is moving up. And that is moving up. So we're moving along good. So I got a 90, everything's pretty reliable on this. This is the pride, the tried and true system we got working here. This is a long duration mission. This is the last one of them all. Система управления ракетоносителя в норме. Стабилизация изделия устойчивая. Параметры конструкции ракетоносителя в норме.
working good. We're working good. We're looking good. Moscow, we're looking good. We're at seven. Eight. Uh oh. This could be bad. Alright, systems are nominal. We fixed the issue. We'll go to nine. Re entry. Still ejecting. There we go. Success. Some more prestige points earned. Extended duration. Hey, I got an achievement. Woohoo! <clears throat> There we go. And our rockets, the Vostok spacecraft and that, are pretty solid at this point. Also, oh, the, the United States has opened up the Orbiting Frog O Autolith, whatever that is. The fallen goals have been achieved. The fallen Cosmon has graduated from advanced training. Fallen Cosmo has been hired and yep, following flight controllers have been undergoing basic training, blah blah. More, more. Upgrade process for falling buildings has ended. Cosmonaut Center. Nice. So, we are literally rolling. Rolling, rolling, rolling. This building cannot be upgraded. This building cannot be upgraded. Alright, well that doesn't really, I don't really need that right now. So, still got two astronauts available. One should be bedridden though. Yep. One's bedridden. Let's see if we can get the two-man guys up there now. Now that I have all the mission control... No, I don't, do I? I still have to wait until they get out of advanced training. So i got one more season. The problem is that the next mission for the Soyuz, or not the Soyuz, but the, the Vostok, is a joint launch in orbital flight, which means I need two two of each which probably means I need Vostok and Vostok let me just take a look here you need at least three cosmonauts to be able to order okay so you need two plus the three I'm wondering how many flight controllers I'll need let's find out let's free up one more cosmonaut He doesn't need to be a... Okay. Alright, so back. And schedule mission. So we could... Add... Oh, so this is good. So our... Uh... Mission control is the same, and he will go there. Environmental, put you there, put you there. Fido, you'll go there. Network, you'll go there. Guidance, procedures, surgeon, him, and Capcom will be the lowest piloting skill we have, which is him. 
Alright. Confirm assignments. Cosmonaut will be you. Cosmonaut you will be you. Confirm assignments. Okay. Back to complex. I think we're all good. Let's do this one last mission and we'll call it an episode. Probably ran a little bit long on this. I apologize if that is the case. But sometimes I lose track of where I am. So all this stuff is getting up there. Nice, nice. And proceed. So 99% chance for, for uh, reliabilities. Interestingly enough, that doesn't include everything, but it's it's kind of it kind of does and it kind of doesn't. All right, so here we go. Countdown. Параметры системы управления ракетоносителя в норме. Стабилизация изделия устойчивая. Параметры конструкции ракетоносителя в норме. There we go. Orbital flight. So now he's in orbit. Yes. Now the second launch. Woo! Success! Countdown. We're up and running, yeah! Yeah, there goes the second vessel. Now we have to orbit, and I'm sure we'll have to intercept too. Or is this just two people in orbit at the same time? Joint over orbital flight. Yeah! Wonder if they'll show both re entries or just one. Well, they'd have to do both of them, wouldn't they? Because... Well... Yeah, because I'm only on 18, so there's 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. Yay! First guy is back, baby! Now it's his turn. Success. Re-entry. Success. Ejection. Yeah. Yeah. All right. That's what I'm talking about. Soviets, man. The Soviets. I got 3,000 prestige points for that. I should have been using another rocket, but oh well. Joint manned launch. Sweet. Look at that. You can't get any better for that, that friggin' thing. Done. Pretty much sure that means they failed. The red means they failed. Oh no, mission essentially accomplished. So the Gemini orbital flight has been done. Awesome. All right. 
So, we are moving along. But, as always, guys, that's the end of the episode. This is Malkuth 1974. We'll see you next time. Subscribe, comment, and rate, and all that good jive. Malkuth, out.